After all that BS the gingerbread illiterates over on Twitter were talking about Hi-Fi Rush, it would appear as though Forspoken's studio is being shut down and rolled into Square Enix, kind of like Volition was shut down and rolled into Gearbox after their joke of a Saints Row woke piece of crap. You wouldn't even want to touch it with a toilet paper with some gloves with a stick, you know what I'm saying? Just light the building on fire type stuff. Not literally. Figuratively, YouTube. <coughs> no, stop, stop demonetizing me. It's funny. Whenever we have criticism, we're told, It's just not for you. Don't like it. Don't buy it. You know, on this like Brie Larson. We're not making it for white men. Type garbage. But if it wasn't for us, it doesn't look like it was for anybody because the studio shut down, homie. You know what I'm so up offended by Project Eve's protagonist. Because like the, with the camera angles chosen, it just felt like this game seems like a, a game that came out in like 002 in terms of its, you know, like character design. Okay, pretty women are dated according to this it's guy. Like a bit old and, and not flattering, I don't think, for a modern audience. Wow, for a modern audience. In, in comparison to something like Forspoken, which has, you know, uh, I mean, yes, it has a much more realistic looking character designs. Uh, it's not these hyper proportioned uh, something or another's but white boy saw a nice ass and said hyper proportioned something or another's I don't understand. I don't understand. They said it was a massive success. This can't be happening. Four spoken. What about five spoken? Are you telling me that I shut down a freaking studio with my mind? Uh, I guess that's something I do now. <laughs> you know, you should have done. You should have just made Deborah Wilson every character. It would have saved a lot of money. I'm sure she's just saved with some hard drives. You know what I mean? Just make Deborah Wilson every character. And then at least we can have less ugly people. You heard me say less? <laughs> it's just a joke. It's just a joke. Deborah Wilson's a sexy woman. She would find that funny too. Because she fucks with comedy. Y'all don't know that. Y'all don't know that. This game shut down. All right. Fuck you. All right. I feel like the most important aspect of this is that nobody's going to learn any lessons. <laughs> you know what I mean? Rumbleverse shut down yesterday. The servers, uh, uh, what was the other one, man? Uh, it's Babylon's Fall, okay? Avengers is shutting down soon. And, and here come Rocksteady said, y'all know what's up? I'm going to do that too. I'm going to do that too. Oh, with the Justice League? You're not going to make them ugly like, like, <laughs> like Avengers did, right? Justice League. Nah, the Justice League could die for all I care. What you mean? What you mean they could die, bro? They could die. I'm gonna make a, I'm gonna make a Suicide Squad one. No, man, don't do that, man. I'm gonna make, uh, I'm gonna make Harley ugly. What are you doing? I'm gonna make this nigga black. But he was white for the other game, so it's a new universe? Nah, same universe, son. What? You, come on, make sense. You wouldn't dare. Here go my preview. Look at Sefton Hill. Didn't he leave the studio? I don't care. <laughs> you don't care. Oh, you got skins? It's going to be a battle pass in that bitch for real. Please say it ain't so. It's okay. Look at these palette swap skins. You like that? No. <laughs> no. Not after Avengers. Please. Please. How about he wear a Superman <laughs> you guys are so creative you know what i mean what if we put him in a superman in a wonder woman outfit a hyper conservative wonder woman but you got your hand out for more expecting money for cosmetics in a space you're watching genshin dominate in genshin has like one skin extra for each character <laughs> That's how nice the waifus are. Mm -hmm. How flashy those moves are. And if you think that comparison shouldn't even be made, look how similar Boomerang's ultimate is to a character named Keixing. Pretty similar, right? Pretty similar, right? Similar like this situation is to all of these other fucking games that, you know, have new management. This is what I'm trying to impress upon most people. You look at Rocksteady and you still see Bungie, but Rocksteady is 343 now. They just kept the same name. Y'all really ruined the jiggle physics, beautiful walk animations of a confident femme fatale 
Rocksteady. Go watch a video by Crobcat called Lawbreakers in an Oversaturated Market. If Rocksteady was just dropping a $70 game and that was that, who could say anything? But you're dropping a $70 game, you got a paid battle pass on top of that, you're pretty much just building this game around cosmetics, but your cosmetics are a visible and significant downgrade from what was visible eight years ago, specifically as it pertains to women. Hmm. Is your studio full of the types of Saints Row motherfuckers that think, oh, you know, Lara Croft definitely would have worked if she was dressed like a nun? You're not just stupid. You're out of touch, man. I genuinely derive satisfaction. Makes me want a pelvic thrust when I think about how Cammy, with a single ass cheek, smothered your garbage showcase. It's just again and again and again and again, and we can't be expected to give a shit about it. It's a, it's point and laugh time. That's what these dumbass kids don't understand is that it's not our first or. 50th rodeo almost heaven more like hell where are my mods what y'all out here trying to sell why you telling lies dog we've been dealing 10 years with this damn creation engine clunky buggy glitchy causing apprehension not to mention hypertension why can't i move why can't i move turn off the bloom i'm out of room i'm out of room spoiled food ground ain't smooth ground ain't smooth dude ugh, i'm out of room i'm out of room spoiled food back in my camp i turned drunk to scrap i'm back on the prowl i need more Kill super mutants, drop mini guns, weigh 20 pounds, oh no. Kill scorch beasts and death claws with piss poor AI. Steal brotherhood in the wrong place and the FOV won't slide. Answer me this beat, Heinz. I know you're not the Lord guy, but start by telling me why. I can't modify. Looking at graphics so ugly that I wanna die. Lag is spiking and now I'm dead, so I come back, shoot him in the head. Even though I pumped him full of lead fallout, will not give me my cred. It sucks when I try hard to complete a quest. To clear a silo and launch a nuke, but the game disconnects. Come back in, can't fast travel over and come for bitch. You telling me my motherfucking camp don't exist? These games will keep shutting down as long as they keep sucking balls. And something that I keep impressing upon people is even good games can suffer a terrible fate. Avengers killed Guardians of the Galaxy. But... I think it's smart to appeal and when it's clear that you know the people behind the scenes are incapable of kind of giving people what they want you know what i mean i i i think of live services and people spending time in them these days like i do a sand mandala sand mandala is a tibetan buddhist tradition involving the creation and destruction of mandalas made from colored sand once complete, the sand mandala's ritualistic dismantling is accompanied by ceremonies and viewings to symbolize the Buddhist doctrinal belief in the transitory nature of material life. Easy come, easy go. This is only a thing for a moment. Let's just have the time that we can have while we can have it. And that's all well and good. But I think you got to be upfront with people and let them know, hey, baby, this could shut down any time, you know, depending on whether or not a lot of other people think this is cool. So, uh, you know what I mean? And that's 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 pressure on them to, you know, wail out because some of them are genuinely stupid enough to believe like maybe if they just keep spending that it won't shut down. Uh. And beautifully, poetically, even. Many of them were doomed to fail because of the hang-ups of weirdos working on them, preventing them from being profitable. Man, oh man, there's insecurity, and then there's just being a bitch-ass nigga, studio full of pussies, you know what I'm saying? Damn, Asian studio would not allow their hang-ups to cost everybody from making money. Jeez. And the gayest part is it's all because of titties. That's crazy. Y'all would rather put him on a man and then parade that around on your show, gaming industry. Ooh, and you you diving in front of them games that got nice. No, that's not okay. We said you better not buy Hogwarts Legacy because I don't want to get running. Oh, yo, yeah, I'm going to spoil the game for you. Oh, yeah. Damn. Y'all thought Xbox versus PlayStation was stupid, man. Jesus.